So shortly after the resurrection, uh, the Lord Jesus appears to the apostles and noticing that they are in the upper room and they're overcome by fear and trembling, his first words are peace to you. That when he enters into our situations when we're a little overworked or overburdened or fearful or anxious, that the Lord's presence ought to bring us peace. It ought to settle our nerves. And he asks them, why are you troubled? Why do you question these things in your heart? And then he begins to open the scriptures to them, to show them the ways that he was supposed to suffer, that the Son of Man was supposed to be wounded, that, they were, that he was wounded for their joy, for their salvation, for their hope, for their well-being, for their entrance into heaven. And so we've gone through Lent and we've gone through Holy Week and the crucifixion of Jesus to finally arrive at this point that it was through his stripes that we are now healed. It was through his sacrifice that we are now saved. It was through his death that we are now given life. And then he challenges us not to just hold this and sit still, but to be filled with his Holy Spirit that we can go out to go forward and bring the good news to all that we meet that his, that his death and resurrection has saved us.